Hi everyone. What do you mean by directional derivative? What was the geometric interpretation of the directional derivative? You know all the answer uh, answer to all my questions. You know all these answers also. Yesterday we have studied. Today we are going to study the remaining portion. So, what, what are the properties of this directional derivative? What are the properties of the directional derivative? What was the definition of the directional derivative which is denoted by duf which is defined as del dot u. Using the dot product definition this is mod del f into mod u into cos theta is equal to we know that this u is unit vector so mod u is always mod u is always equal to 1 so this is given by mod del f into cos theta the next properties of this directional derivative properties of this directional derivative so first property we have from this definition we can we can define, we can see some properties of this definition. Okay. So, we have this mod f cos theta, mod f cos theta. Uh, this cos theta has the highest value. Cos theta varies from word cos theta minus 1 less than or equal to cos theta less than or equal to 1 the cos theta maximum value is 1. So, here the maximum value of what, what will be the maximum value of this that is this value this value will be highest when cos theta is equal to 1 and uh, you can easily say that uh, this is this is what you can easily say that uh, this is uh, lowest value then cos theta is minus 1. So, we can say that uh, this is lowest when cos theta equal to 1 this will be mod del f and when cos theta equal to minus 1 this will be minus mod del f. So, the value of duf have maximum value when cos theta is 1 that is theta is equal to what will be that theta equal to 0 and this will have my minimum value when cos theta is minus 1 that is theta equal to pi that is we are going to explain. So, the first property is f increases f increases or f have maximum value most rapidly most rapidly when cos theta is when cos theta equal to 1. When cos theta equal to 1 then duf is equal to mod del f. duf equal to mod del f. When cos theta equal to 1 implies theta equal to 0 which implies del f and u are in the same same direction are in the same direction ok. So, I can say that this f increases most rapidly increases most rapidly when when this is a star mark when u is a unit vector u is in the direction of when u is in the direction of del f u is in the direction of del f ok. So, what will be the second property? Similarly, we can say that uh, this duf is minimum when 
this is equal to this equal to minus mod del f when cos theta is equal to minus 1 when cos theta equal to minus 1 this equal to minus mod del f when cos theta equal to minus 1 means theta equal to pi which implies del f and u are in opposite direction opposite direction okay so f decreases rapidly most rapidly in the direction of in the direction of in the direction of minus del f and the third property is third property is duf is equal to del f dot u which is equal to which is equal to mod del f into mod u into cos theta which is equal to 0 when cos theta equal to 0 that is theta equal to pi by 2 therefore del f and u lies perpendicular that is orthogonal that is when del f and u are perpendicular or del f is orthogonal to this u then du f has no changes no changes okay so these are the important properties of this duf directional derivative in the direction of u okay the first one was first one was f increase most rapidly when u is in the direction of mode del f and the maximum value is actually mode del f and the maximum value is mode del f similarly f decreases most rapidly in the direction of minus del f that means in the opposite direction minus del f and uh, the value is minimum value is minus mod del f okay and the last property is del f and u are when del f and u are orthogonal then the there is no directional derivative okay next i am going to do some uh, do a problem this is question find the direction in which f of x y equal to x square by 2 plus y square by 2 first one is increases most rapidly second one decreases most rapidly at 1 1 next what are the directions of 0 change in f at 1 1 so the solution is given by given that f of x y equal to x square by 2 plus y square by 2 x square by 2 plus y square by 2 so we have to find out fx that is 2x by 2 that is x and fy equal to 2y by 2 that is y so fx at 1 1 equal to 1 fy at 1 1 equal to 1 therefore del f equal to fx i plus f i j that is equal to i plus x i plus y j. So, del f at the point 1 1 equal to i plus j. Okay, this is this is 
and its direction is given by and first question is find the direction in which f of x y increases most rapidly in which direction f increases most rapidly and we know that from the properties of the directional derivative f increases most rapidly f increases most rapidly rapidly in the direction of in the direction of more in the direction of del f in the direction of del f and maximum value is mode del f therefore del f equal to i plus j and mode del f is equal to mode del f is equal to what is that root 2 so f increases f increases most rapidly rapidly in the direction of in the direction of del f so in the direction of we have to find out u unit vector mode del f divided by mode del f which is equal to i plus j divided by root so in this direction uh, the f increases most rapidly so in which direction f decreases rapidly what will be, will be the answer b is equal to in which direction this equal to minus i by root 2 minus j by root 2 ok and uh, what are the directions of next to last one is the third one what are the directions of zero change in f at uh, 1 1 what are the directions of zero change the directions of zero change means this del f is orthogonal to u ok so we have del f is equal to what i plus j or u equal to then u must be equal to what have what what will be this this del f dot u must be equal to 0 uh, like that we have to select this that is equal to del f dot u is must be equal to 0 that is I am going to take that i plus j dot a i plus b j this is i plus j by root 2 this is the this equal to 0 what is equal to a by root 2 plus b by root 2 is equal to 0 so a equal to minus b like that we have to choose this this so u can be this direction minus 1 by root 2 into i plus 1 by root 2 into j or u equal to 1 by root 2 into y minus 1 by root 2 into j in this direction if we choose this one this dot this del of must be equal to 0 or if if we are choosing this choosing this one then this will be the dot product of this one must, must, must be 0 so you will be you we have to choose this is equal to 0 ok next I am going to define define the gradient and the tangents to level curves that is a what do you, what is the geometrical meaning of this gradient 